Students piled in the classrooms today across Wisconsin, including in the state's largest district, entering a more normal school year than we have known for the past couple of years. Carol Meekins is also getting schooled. She's joining us live inside <laughs> Bruce Elementary School. Carol. That is right. I am getting schooled, Steve. <laughs> school bells rang today for thousands of MPS students and wearing masks now optional. I'm here at Bruce Elementary where students and teachers are ready to welcome a new school year. In fact, the principal tells me their motto is lead with love. Are you excited about the first day? Oh my gosh, absolutely. Class is in session here at Bruce Elementary near 89th and Mill Road in Milwaukee. Bright-eyed students eager for day one. Why are you excited about the first day of school? Because I get to see my friends that I didn't see in a, in a while. And I get to see new people. Cameron, can you tell me what you like best about school? Math. Wow, you must be very smart, aren't you? Yeah. Wow, you like math. Now, what's your other favorite subject? Reading. What's the best thing about coming to school? Making new friends and having fun. Now, do you like things like this in the hall, George? Yes, I love things like this. I love art. Fifth grader George Norwood loves to help other students, and he gives Bruce Elementary high marks. Do you like this school? A lot. It is very nice, very big, and it's a lot of things to play with and a lot of people to play with. Principal Lisa Turner is thrilled to be back to normal and see kids' uncovered faces. I've been waiting for this day, right, for, to see these smiling faces. It's been a long time. Um, and again, to see their smiles and their excitement. Now, if you were telling kids come into school the first day and they might be a little bit nervous here at Bruce Elementary, how would you make them feel comfortable, George? By telling them to stay on track and do not mess up. George is so smart. Now, Principal Lisa Turner tells me the school is really grateful after volunteers from GE Medical did a wonderful job painting and fixing up the classrooms recently. Their work included colorful murals with positive messages for the kids. And coming up a little later in this newscast, you're going to hear from Milwaukee Public School Superintendent Dr. Keith Posley about some changes taking place at MPS this year. Meanwhile, Governor Tony Evers helped welcome students back to class while at the same time proposing nearly $2 billion in funding for public schools statewide. He says that investment would improve literacy rates, provide mental health resources for students, and keep teachers in the classroom. We need to make sure that more educators and staff in our schools and our classrooms are there to keep class sizes small and make sure our kids have the support they need to be successful. Now, the governor says this plan would be covered by the $5 billion surplus the state will have at the end of the fiscal year. Meanwhile, Republican candidate for Governor Tim Michaels criticized Evers. Michaels said, quote, his plan for education is the same as it always is, more money and more bureaucracy.